Okay, uh, hello again. Now we're gonna show you a survival trick uh, that's very important when you have uh, used uh, all the wine you think in your uh, wine bib. Uh, lightweight uh, lightweight uh, wine packaging. So, okay, uh, now uh, my friend uh, uh, Moi called, <laughs> Moi called oh, the, la the last Moi, yeah. Gonna <laughs> feel it. Uh, Okay, you use you, for this. You can use this kind of knife because it's. Uh, uh, That's the bad one. Uh, and then you 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 take this is the bib you can see, and then you. I have pre-cut it because uh, uh, so that you hadn't see it, need to see it on the um, film. And then uh, you you just like this. You can suck it, and then you get the last to draw. Mm. You see the technique as he's clemming uh, the bag like that, that was in the box. Like a tube of Kalles caviar. <laughs> in, in a survival situation this can be very crucial. Um, Mm. So tasty. Uh, thanks. Uh, it's very important to use all parts of the animal when you kill it in the forest, and it's very important to use all parts of the bib when you have uh, drunk it. So that's why we're gonna. This one uh, we're gonna use uh, to put on the fire and then burn it up. And this part uh, we will uh, put on the fire and oi. oh no, oh my, and burn it up. Oh my god! Oh my god! Mm. <laughs> Oh no, uh, uh, sometimes I, you can think that uh, me uh, spilling the wine there would have exposed me as a fraud in survival uh, expertise, but actually there can be pockets of wine that's very very hard to detect, and while it's very, it's minus 40,000 degrees outside, so it's very cold for my hands to feel the wine, and that's why it, this happens, so it has nothing to do with me being a fraud. Bye bye! <laughs> Oh,